one major development that I beg your pardon, I have missed is that in the wee hours of the night, <laughs> our baby up in the sky, India's moon mission, Chandrayaan 3, the lander Vikram, it's on its the Pragyan rover. We've been talking about it, how it's just chilling up there in the, in the space, you know, circling the earth. And now, it finally has taken that, that slingshot. You know, we were speaking about that slingshot maneuver for a very long time. Very and, long time. And uh, they have done it. They fire the engines and uh, it is on its way to the moon. Now, they, once it's in, uh, they try to insert it in the lunar orbit and they will try to achieve an orbit of 100 kilometers, ideally a circular orbit around. That will happen later on. Yeah, yeah it will happen. The later final on. position is going to be 100 kilometers away from the lunar surface, surface exactly. which is when the descent is going to begin. Uh, yeah, slowly but the descent will happen. We're now on a trajectory to uh, the We to are the moon. On, our, on our way to it's the It's going moon. to take about three and a half, four days when we hit the lunar orbit. Once we hit the lunar orbit, then that descending it, at least four maneuvers are required to, to put come it down. in that. Yeah, to put it in to that. Come down to that hundred kilometer orbit. orbit, and from there, deciding on when the south pole is near the dark side of the moon, it's going to come down. Oh, well, and uh, this time I mean, around, it's going to be, um, you know, done a little more safely because we don't want a Chandrayaan two episode to be repeated. But everybody, the ISRO chief, all the technicians, the scientists, they were absolutely confident that this time around it's going to make a successful landing. This is, I, the, and I, this is I, the official I, I, statement. Just, as I was saying, from the time it was launched, uh, I'm so excited about it that <laughs> I, I'm just waiting with my fingers crossed. Uh, Chandrayaan-3 mission. This is what the ISRO has put out, official statement. It says, Chandrayaan-3 completes its orbits around the Earth and heads towards the Moon. A successful perigee firing performed at ISTRAC, ISRO, has injected the spacecraft into the translunar orbit. Next stop, the moon. As it arrives at the moon, the lunar orbit insertion, the LOI, from the translunar injection, the TLI, LOI. now we're looking at the LOI, which is the lunar orbit insertion, is planned for the 5th of August. It's another uh, important date. This is what we're picking up. And there's a proper picture with a proper tweet that, uh, you know, has come out. Uh, I'm going to request the control room, if, if at all you have this picture, do throw up on the big screen over here. Because it shows very nicely how, you know, uh, there's this, the elliptical orbits around the Earth and then that direction towards the moon and then the elliptical orbits around the moon when finally it's going to start slowing its speed and then come into a circular orbit the gravitation is also you know the the, the gravitational pull will also bring it a little closer you albeit this, it's very this weak is a, compared this to the earth you you know uh, we all i think you, you, did you like maths <laughs> <laughs> similar here okay no, no, i have no I mean, the, both of us are not uh, mathematically inclined, but you know, there's so much of maths involved in this. Absolutely. And what you uh, lots of maths and what physics you and a lot of gravity. If I loved and maths, I would be on that spacecraft. <laughs> but he's that spacecraft. I would be and on that spacecraft. a lot of coordination of numbers are required uh, for this to be put in place. And our scientists are uh, attempting something that is very ambitious for us as a uh, spacefaring uh, country because you know the kind of achievements that we see of a lunar probe landing or something is you know to the point which uh, hardly uh, three four uh, space agencies in the world would have achieved um, our neighbor china has also uh, done it but there have been several attempts at it so i think the moon is there we've been able to go up to hmm. mars with a lot of gravity oh well there you have it yeah that's the particular tweet that's been put out by uh, you know ha, the space research organization and that's the picture uh, but that is still that's a july 25th picture mm -hmm. the next firing for the translunar injection is planned for august 1st 2023 between 12 midnight and this 1 is what has happened already ist and that uh, is something that has already taken place it this has been done successfully um, and uh, this mission is on its way it's on the right track uh, let's hope uh, for a successful to landing, uh, Pragyan, uh, landing, India is going to become the only only the fourth nation to have probably have successfully attempted a soft landing. Successfully soft landed, uh. what an attempt! Successfully soft landed on the dark side of the moon, if and it it's going to work so only for great. 15 days, Vargis, because ah, one, that is because of the lunar one lunar day, day is, is equal to one, put, put 15 put Earth days, and once the sun goes out, our machines most probably. I mean, it's going to be a bonus if the machines are still working when the sun comes up after 15 days, but unlikely so. A hundred, almost minus temperature, uh, the machines 14, won't have 14. the solar so you have power a, to you have, work. Uh, you have a 14 uh, day kind of a window in which you have to carry out all your experiments. And we were talking about how uh, Chandrayaan uh, 2 had, uh, or the mission Chandrayaan had detected about water molecules within the moon. So we're just trying to figure out how that works. So a lot of importance given to this mission. 
Uh, also, it's not only us who's going to the moon. The Americans are trying to get back to the moon with their Artemis mission, mm. uh, which is going to be uh, progressively become a manned mission after the Apollo series. Uh, we know that the Apollo, uh, you know, uh, missions were thwarted or rather aborted by, in, by 1970s and it became an expensive affair to go to the moon. So they had thwarted it and then they had new space technology. We were still in the orbit around the Earth with our uh, uh, shuttles and the Artemis mission is going to be another attempt to go to the moon and back. Even as looking at the Chandrayaan, there is a Gaganyaan that we also have to focus on. The yes. Samudrayaan is also that we have to look on uh, because in the same way, Gaganyan would be our it's attempt like, to it's, it's like this. It's like you're you're reaching the heights up there in the space and deep inside the water as well. What's going to happen? We'll have to wait and find out. I'm very excited. We're nearing that 20, August 23rd date. Before you know it, we're going to be there, the fourth nation on the planet to attempt to land on the to moon. land successfully soft land on the moon.